In this video, you guys are going to discover five easy typing jobs that you can do in 2024. And no, these aren't your typical jobs like converting audio to video and transcribing or data analysis. These are five jobs that you probably have heard about, but maybe you haven't. And the great thing about it is that you don't need any prior experience. I love it. My team and I have spent many hours doing the research on these videos. And if you like that, we've done these research for you. Go ahead and hit like on the video. Not only that, if you are new to our channel and haven't subscribed yet, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell because we've got videos on a Tuesday and Thursday and you don't want to miss any of our videos. Now let's get to the list at number five. Number five is document scanning and indexing specialists. Now I know that sounds like a mouthful, but a document scanning and index specialist is basically someone who helps organize and manage digital documents. So they use scanners to convert paper documents into digital files. They label and categorize documents so that they can be easily searched and found. They check scan files and make sure that they are clear and accurate. They enter key information from documents into computer systems, and they also ensure that all digital documents are stored securely and easily accessible to those who need them. And they make a good amount of money earning approximately in between $43,000 entry level to $64,000, depending on the years of experience that you have. And some of the skills that you will need in order for you to do this job successfully is attention to detail because you need to be detailed in making sure that the information is accurate and in the right documents. Not only that, you have to have a good understanding of how to scan documents and strong organizational skills. And to get started in a role like this, all you have to do is get familiar with document scanning and indexing tools, and then look for entry level positions with companies or organizations requiring document management services and be prepared to showcase your organizational skills during interviews. Coming in at number four is a tax preparer. A tax preparer helps people in businesses with their taxes. So they collect financial documents like income statements, receipts, and expenses. They use this information to figure out how much tax is owed or how much of a refund is due. And then they fill out and submit tax forms to the government on behalf of their clients. And they also can provide advice on how to reduce tax liabilities and to take advantage of deductions and credits. And tax preparers can earn a good amount of money with an average salary of about $57,000 dollars a year and the skills that you will need is to understand different tax laws and regulations and not only that you have to have a good attention to detail and be accurate because you're going to be preparing people's tax returns you also need to have excellent communication skills and excellent relationship building skills in order for you to attract clients and keep those clients and provide personalized tax advice and to get started obtain relevant tax preparation certifications or licenses such as the enrolled agent an ea or certified public accountant a cpa and then gain experience through internships or entry-level positions with tax preparation firms and consider offering tax preparation services yourself now next on the list is a remote research assistant and the remote research assistant helps with research tasks from a remote location like their home. And they also do things like gather information, such as collect data and information from various sources like books, articles, and online databases. They also review and interpret data to find useful insights and patterns. And not only that, they write summaries and reports based on the research that they've done. And a remote research assistant can earn anywhere from in between $42,000 a year and $70,000 a year, depending on your experience and specialization. And the skills that you will need are strong research skills, attention to detail and critical thinking skills, and excellent organizational skills. And to get started, start by identifying your areas of interest or expertise, and then researching opportunities within companies or academic institutions seeking research assistance and continue to develop your research skills and compile a portfolio showcasing your abilities. And next on the list at number two is a technical support advisor. And a technical support advisor basically helps people solve technical problems with their devices or their software. So they identify and fix problems with computers, phones, or software. They also give step-by-step -step instructions to help customers resolve their own technical issues. And they also may respond to customer questions about how to use certain products and services. And technical support advisors can earn anywhere in between $36,000 a year to $53,000 a year with the potential to earn even more with bonuses based on your performance. And the skills that you will need are a good understanding of how to troubleshoot hardware and software, not only that strong communication skills, 
and patience and empathy. And to get started, start by familiarizing yourself with common technical support protocols and troubleshooting techniques, and then look for entry-level positions with companies offering technical support roles and be prepared to demonstrate your problem-solving skills during the interviews. And last and final on the list is an appointment setter. And an appointment setter basically is an individual who helps to schedule meetings and appointments for businesses. So they call potential clients or customers who set up meetings or appointments. They arrange and confirm appointment times that work for both the client and the business. They give clients details about the services or products that's being offered. And they keep track of scheduled appointments and update the calendars or the day databases. And this is one of those hybrid type of roles of customer service and sales. And the pay is pretty good with an average salary in between $45,000 a year to $70,000 a year, depending on the level of experience that you have. And the skills that you need to do this job successfully is excellent communication skills and relationship building skills. Not only that, persuasive and convincing abilities. Not only that, a good understanding of how to handle objections and rejections gracefully. And to get started, begin by honing your communication skills and understanding a product or service that you may be promoting or you may be interested in. And not only that, look for opportunities with companies offering appointment setting roles or sales development roles. And there you have it, folks. These are the five easy typing jobs that you can do in 2024. And many of these you can start without any prior experience at all and if you found this video helpful don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit like on the video and not only that if you are new to our channel go ahead and hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to be alerted when we drop content on tuesday and thursday because you don't want to miss those videos and hey if you have any questions or suggestions for future videos drop them in the comment sections below and we will see you on the next video until next time guys peace